Hi, I'm Bonnie LeFever with the design demo from Pioneer Imports and Wholesale. Today our project is creating a beautiful wall piece using the reclaimed wood finish in the wall decor. Now this is the largest of a set of four that's available from Pioneer Imports and Wholesale. You'll find that this is a fantastic product. It's lightweight, beautiful coloration that works well into the home decor line. What we're using as well is the beautiful garland of a willow, it's a willow garland, the hanging wood fern, and two pre-made bushes that are from the Artisan Vision collection. Now you can see these are beautiful combinations that they have already been put together so it works well for the design that we're coming up with today and many of other projects that you're working on. And also we have a little bit of the um, sheet moss to finish up. So as we start this project, what we want to do is kind of visualize what's going to happen in this wall piece. And what I've done is use the permanent foam and I've just hot glued this into the back side of this because this gives us the um, insertion points that we need for the design. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and put this on the wall. What you'll notice is part of the beauty of this as well is it really has hangers already built in. We have points that we can hang this on the wall, just a couple um, of lightweight nails because it is very lightweight and easy for us to use. I'm just going to move this around and put it in place. And then we can start our construction of our design. We're going to start with this beautiful hanging wood fern and make insertions. As you can see, I've already pre-cut this, so it makes it much easier and quicker for us to come up with this, show you, demonstrate this design work. As you can see clearly, just doing insertions into the foam to give us that look. I really suggest you start first of all with this foliage because then you'll be able to tell you know where you want to work in the rest of your flowers okay so we, you can see what kind of groupings that we, we have in the design now i'm going to look at what we have in the individual bushes that we've already pre-cut and i'm going to look at the colors of the flowers that um, are going together because we don't want it to look like a big polka dot we want this to have a lot of um, visual impact and to do that we need to, to group these flowers together. So as you can see the beautiful dahlia that was in this dahlia bush, we add those as a visual when we're taking our heavier colored flowers because visually that gives us more visual weight and we're grouping those towards the center to bring our eye there. A lighter flower both in weight visually and um, Material-wise is the little daisy, it's like a little daisy. So we're going to move those over to this corner. And in the bush also, there's another little type of fern, and this has a little bit of yellow color to it. So we're going to incorporate this as well, because that gives us a little bit more color and texture that we're seeing here. All wired, makes it real easy for us to manipulate and put wherever we think we want to put that. Now in the other bush, we have a couple other dark colors. So again, keeping in mind that we want to keep that to the center of the design. That stronger color, we're going to bring in through here, towards the bottom. And again, mimicking the light color that we have on the other side, we're going to do the same with this daisy, which is a little bit larger, move back to the other side. A little shorter visually, we can really get the impact on that. Again, we have the dahlia in the one bush, we had it in the, the coral color. This one we have in the cream, so we're going to bring those through here. As you can see, we have the cream, and we're trying not to just stay our all. Make sure you're getting an amount of depth in the design as you're going through this. And we look and say, well, what else do we have that we want to really focus? And we have a beautiful hydrangea. We have two different colorations, one from each of the different bushes. And then the teal, just a very light teal. And some delphinium. And those 
towards the center. And you can see how we're creating a beautiful pattern in the, the, the wood creation here. Now then, we do have some bright color that I do want to balance over to the left-hand side here to give us some, bring that color, or pull that color on through the, the, the um, wall piece that we're creating. And then we have a few of our filler type flowers. And you can see the foliage on here is really important that we use this as well because it's helping fill in anything that we want to create a little bit of filling space, bringing the white over from one side of the design to the other. And then we, as you can see, we're down to just a couple important elements to add through the design. So we look and say, well, where do we need to balance that? And I see I have a, a strong cream line here, but I do not have anything on this line to bring that cream. So I am going to bring this here to balance that over on the other side. So we've got that little stilby look in here. Now we have this almost complete, but what we see is a little bit of disconnect because of where we have the flowers in many different places. And to really make a visual connection to this, we're going to take this beautiful willow garland and we're just going to wrap it around and make it so visually it looks like it's bringing it all together for us. So you can decide how many pieces of the garland you need to add, but it doesn't have to be a lot. It just needs to be enough so that we can see visually that it's putting all these individual components together. So this could really be all we need to bring that together on, on the design. And then to finish it off, what you're going to want to do is just to go in, take your floral adhesive, add just a little bit of that to your moss, and tuck this in wherever you would see any of that moss that's, or excuse me, that uh, foam that's existing. So we're just going to do a little tuck in here. We want to do blue and tuck, but I just give you the idea. You can see that you finish it off with that. So thanks for joining me for this design demo from Pioneer Imports and Wholesale.